What's up guys, how's it going? Mike the Tech here, and today I'm going to show you how to uh, split your audio based on what app you're using to different outputs. So for example, you can have Discord going to your headset, but you can have Spotify going to your uh, room speakers. Uh, and you can split this between any of the devices connected to your computer and um, any of the apps that are um, playing audio on your computer. So it's a really easy process. All we have to do is go into your audio settings here, right click on that, and go to Volume Mixer. Now, Volume Mixer is useful in itself in that it will allow you to change the volume on an app basis. So if I want to change Chrome and have it a little bit lower, but have um, system sounds all the way up, or if I want the opposite, if I want Chrome all the way up, but system sounds to be not as loud because they're pretty loud, um, you can do that here. But in order to split them to different devices, you can actually click on this little down arrow right here. So for example, Chrome, I can say, instead of being the default output device, which is my speakers, I want Chrome specifically to play in my headset. And I can choose headset here. And then um, I want my system sounds to play out of the default device. Um, but any app that you have open, for example, let's open up, um, let's start something here. Let's mute this. Um, and then Razer Synapse, uh, not Razer Synapse, Vivaldi will show up. And I can say Vivaldi, I want to come out of the computer speakers, but I want um, Chrome to come out of my headphones. So yeah, that's basically how you um, are able to get that set up so that every single um, uh, app can be specifically controlled to what device it gets output to. This is specifically useful in streaming when, for just that example, you might want your Discord chat to come out of your headphones, but you might want system audio to come out of another device. Uh, but yeah, uh, that's about it. If you have any questions, leave them in the question or comment section below. And as always, uh, thank you so much for watching. If you want to say thanks, click on that thanks or join button below. Have a great day. Peace. What? You've never heard of Stream Savers? And you thought PewDiePie was the only YouTuber to make a game? I made a game too, and it's called Stream Savers, and it's available for pre-order right now for $9.99. And that's a great price!